at 7.37 a.m. <clears throat> excuse me, on January 4th, 2024, the Perry Police Department responded to an active shooter event at Perry High School. Meanwhile, Dallas County Communications was also receiving multiple 911 calls of an active shooter at the high school. Perry police officers responded within minutes. They immediately made entry and witnessed students and faculty either sheltering in place or running from the school. <clears throat> Once inside, they located multiple individuals with gunshot wounds. Officers immediately attempted to locate the source of the threat and quickly found what appeared to be the shooter with a self-inflicted gunshot wound. As additional officers responded, a systematic approach search of the school took place. Officers located during the search of the school an improvised explosive device. The state fire marshal and the Bureau of Alcohol, Tobacco and Firearms rendered the device safe. Numerous officers from multiple agencies were able to secure the school and verify no additional threats. At the same time, first responders were rendering aid to the victims who were later transported to area hospitals. The shooter has been identified as 17-year-old Dylan Butler, a student at Perry High School. Butler was armed with a pump action shotgun and a small caliber handgun. Butler also made a number of social media posts in and around the time of the shooting. Law enforcement is working to secure those pieces of evidence. All evidence thus far suggests that Butler acted alone. There are six victims, one of them who is deceased. That individual was a sixth grade student at Perry Middle School. The other five are being treated at area hospitals. Four of the surviving student, four of the victim, surviving victims are students, and the fifth is a school administrator. The law enforcement response was swift and immediate. Roughly 150 officers from local, state, and federal agencies responded within the hour. The investigation in today's tragedy is ongoing. The Iowa Division of Criminal Investigation is serving as the lead investigative agency with assistance from the Perry Police Department, the Dallas County Sheriff's Office, the FBI, the ATF, and the Dallas County Attorney's Office. Hi everyone, George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.